What's up people? It has been entirely too long since I've given you an update, so here we go. I'm gonna kinda make it quick. Some driving. But uh today is the 17th of January, Thursday. And I am headed to the doctor for a CT scan. Uh, my last oncologist appointment, um, I talked to my oncologist about some excessive pain that I've been in for the last probably week or so, uh, including some shoulder pain. <laughs> uh, when I talked to him about this, he said that the shoulder pain uh, might be a um, symptom of the liver cancer that I have. Uh, just three little spots on my liver, but um, it might be indicative of liver cancer. So, uh, he set me up with a CT for today, and we are going to go in and find out what all is going on. Uh, this uh, amidst the report from my wife who just called me and told me that my bilirubin uh, marker is going down, which is a good thing, and so is my CA-199, um, which uh, if you've been following along, the CA-199 is a bit of an indicator for, um, for pancreatic cancer. So. You uh, take it a little bit with a grain of salt because uh, it's not an exact number. It doesn't uh, cor uh, correspond directly with pancreatic cancer, but um, it's a good indicator of like things going on. So, um, so that's what's happening. I'm going in for a CT today. We're gonna find out. Um, they can find other pieces and parts of cancer tumors that have maybe spread around. Uh, we're going to look at the liver a little bit closer and we are going to also get a bone scan, which I've never had before, but I'm told is, I don't know, a two-part scan? I don't, I don't know what it's all about, but apparently I get scanned and then I take a break or something like that and then I come back and get scanned again so I don't know I guess that's how it works so see how that goes but um, that's the latest on the uh, chemo front on in other news um, this weekend we are going to Tampa Florida to get uh, to go to Universal Studios and restaurants and sleep at a decent hotel and all of this is being sponsored by the Jack and Jill Foundation. Jack and Jill Foundation, uh, as I understand it, is sort of a uh, make-a-wish type thing for adults with uh, terminal cancer. And uh, they have been absolutely fantastic to work with. Um, basically, they send you on a vacation so that you can live uh, and experience and have fun and forget all about cancer for a little while while you enjoy yourself um, doing various activities. In our case, the, uh, the uh, state of Florida, the tourism board for Tampa is actually helping to sponsor this, and uh, we couldn't be more grateful for the opportunity. We're looking forward to getting out of the state of Minnesota, where it is currently 19 degrees, and hitting the beaches of Florida, where last time I looked, it's supposed to be in the upper 60s while we're there this weekend, so... Totally looking forward to that. Um, and then the following week, we come back on a Monday, I believe it is, and 
or Tuesday, I can't remember, it's either Monday or Tuesday that we come back from Tampa, and then we have a day uh, of rest, and then on, I believe it is Friday of next week, we go to California, where uh, a friend of ours is a producer of a show, and uh, he has arranged for us to meet the star of that show, so we are totally stoked about that. That is actually more of a bucket list item for my son, who, if he could, he would be there right now uh, as of Christmas when we when we gave him this uh, this gift. Um, couldn't be more thankful of that opportunity, and we're looking forward to getting out again of the cold weather and hitting California. So it's going to be a hoot. Um, of course, I'll be taking pictures, lots of pictures, on both of these uh, little vacations, and. Uh, and we'll be posting those up to Instagram, of course. Not my personal um, personal Facebook account, as well as my wife's. But uh, keep on watching PancanOverland.com for updated pictures from that those trips and uh, and more. So. Hope you guys are having an awesome week. We uh, are looking forward to the weekend. It's gonna be a blast. And uh, let me know what you're doing. Um, I got stuff planned for 2019 that I haven't quite announced yet, but all sorts of plans for that. Uh, it's going to be a awesome year this year. So thank you everybody for watching, for your support, for your likes, for your subscriptions to this channel um, I don't have a lot of subscriptions but I'm that's okay I'm all right with that I um, just tell my story about cancer and uh, haven't been nearly as many adventures as I'd like at least not overlanding adventures and we hope to change that in 2019 so Hope you guys have a great week and, uh, and weekend, and uh, watch my Instagram for pictures. Watch pinkinoverland.com for pictures as well and blog updates. And uh, I hope you have an awesome weekend. Thank you for all your support. See you later. Bye.